Seven chats over the Kokora Katnach take a mono mana, quick to Jacumulama Guanga, Netsuganga, to discussing our and to a vision. Those are Geno Mosi, again of Tarich for Chabuini, Mukunga Vuka, Wanga Vuka Vagara, Avuka Nawi, Okuakunga, Oxinga Fawaka Day. Well, a very good morning. Welcome to the latest updates right here on the Buzz UG. And uh, my name is Melans Milo, aka Fuller. Subscribe in case you haven't, and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, according to reports in the media, former General Court Marshal boss, that is Lieutenant Andrew Guti, is said to be in intensive care unit ICU at Nakasero Hospital, fighting for his life after he blacked out. Well, it is said that Guti is grappling with stress, having been prematurely retired from uh, the court martial job and declared redundant. Uh, we all remember his job was recently offered to Lieutenant Robert Mugabe Freeman. I'm following up on this story and I'll keep you posted right here on The Buzz UG. Now, a section of the public on different social media platforms has accused MTN Uganda of colluding with security agencies to abduct people in different parts of the country. According to reports, MTN Uganda discloses the wanted person's information to the security personnel and they start tracking you based on the information received from the telecom company. Well, I should say it was a big topic yesterday on Twitter and uh, many people requested MTN Uganda to respond to the accusations but up to now they are still quiet. But if this comes out to be true, uh, that means MTN can do anything behind your back. Anyway, let's wait uh, for MTN to respond and I'll keep you posted right here on The Buzz UG. <music> Now, a private security guard, Isaac Okello, working with Saracen Security Uganda Limited, has been arrested by Kira Road Police Station after being allegedly caught red-handed with 31 bullets and selling each at 2,000 Uganda shillings, and uh, he was also selling a magazine at 10,000 Uganda shillings. Now, police realized the 31 bullets included 19 for an SMG, 3 for a pistol, 1 for a Mark 4 gun, uh, two for a greener gun and uh, two for a pump action. Now, Patrick Konyango, the Kampala Metropolitan Police spokesperson, uh, confirmed Okello's arrest, saying that efforts to establish the exact source of the weapons are underway. Now, President Museveni has appointed a new commander of uh, the Operation Shuja in the Democratic Republic of Congo, replacing General Mohanga Kayanja, who was recently appointed CDF. Now, Major General Richard Dick Olum, who has been defense advisor at Uganda's embassy in Kinshasa, DRC, was appointed yesterday the new commander, Operation Shuja, and commander of the UPDF Mountain Division. Well, congratulations, and uh, right here on the Buzz UG, we wish him all the best. Now, a section of the public has been questioning why President Museveni's son, Mohozi Kanerugaba, calls UPDF his army. Now, General Mohozi Kanerugaba has finally responded to those who have been condemning him for calling UPDF his army or his soldiers. He says he calls them so because he loves them so much. He says they're like his children. He care about them so much. So basically, that's why he calls them his army. The NRM party has asked President Museveni's son, General Mohozi Kanerugaba, to openly tell the country whether he has come to unseat his father or his campaigning and mobilizing for them as a party so that all people can know what he's up to. This was said by the spokesperson of the party, Emmanuel Dombo. Waliwo ebyasali wawo echobe ngabiga mbanti mwa Museveni asani dabere candidate we NRM mu mwaka ogwedde ne mu maso je bujja. Tiwana bera 
chiwandiko chiralala chonna oba chiteso kikyusa mwecho chigendelera mucho mwami muhozi ali lokucheyo gerera now different political analysts including Kila municipality member of parliament horrible semu junganda have revealed their opinions on general muhozi kanirugaba's next move muhozi ye nga muhozi taina maji taina sente taina na bana byabufuzi ya yagala kusikira busikizi bya kitawe siro za president mu seven na sora kuva mungukano rwabira rwa 2020 mukaga ngatana raba oiro ye wimanyi ya igama nte oiro ye mhozi chali ko cha gamba nte abavuka abaze ku line bade ku line bade me kubera nga bafilinga desperate nti real nte gwanga rimka kya baga mu seven cha so de ku kola kat na chiteka muno mwana kwe kutuja kumulama bwe gwanga ne tusiganga to discussing abantu babiri kati omwana atandi so kwagala ayagala mu seven ya mwe nate mu seven tagenda operation je bakola kwe kukoze sa muhozi ku mobilizing young people uh, kuba delivering to mu seven nze sira sira want tsoboka noza jeno muhozi agenda kutware chifo cha bobi wine mukunga bavubuka kwanga bavubuka bo bagala a a abavuka banawe abafuzi okubakunga okusinga fa bakade well there you go those are different opinions coming in from a different political analyst right here in the country i don't know what to think about this story but in case you have anything on your mind just put it down in the comment section and uh, most importantly subscribe in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications my name is melads milo aka fula it's a bye for now thank you